Hello everybody and welcome to a quick look at the hull enclosure with the Seahawk 40 on a cold and windy day in Brighton so I do apologise for any, any wind noise in advance, it's quite breezy. But let's have a look shall we? So we're on the starboard side of this boat, as you can see we've got the uh, the lovely great big anchor there nestling in its bow roller attached to the chain and uh, the electric windlass there, looks absolutely fantastic. And if I just drop down we can get a little bit closer to the uh, to the hull itself, you can see the waterline. We do have some growth, uh, most of that if not all of that will blast away with the pressure washer as we have a really good one here in Brighton uh, but there would be some residue to sort out no doubt but uh, I'm sure not too much of an issue and if you look along the hull we can see evidence of one or two kisses with the jetties and the pontoons over the years but something uh, that we can probably expect for a boat of this type and age. If we just look up towards the deck level or just below the deck we can see we've got a lovely defendering type uh, rud rubbing strake so uh, that looks a little bit industrial this the whole boat feels slightly industrial in her build and uh, the way she looks um, so that's going to give us good protection from uh, touching those walls and maybe other boats etc etc so we'll just walk along the starboard side I'll just get in a little bit closer again there's defendering have a window there into the uh, starboard forward cabin and uh, there again you can just see a little bit of growth underwater there not too much of an issue and there's a hull and we'll just carry on along the starboard side until we get to the stern Obviously down here we're a little bit congested with fenders with big thick ropes. Um, this is actually the cockpit tent for the flybridge or the flybridge cover I should say. Just uh, placed there out of the way. And uh, down we come to the stern again you can see we're congested with ropes etc. Big thick ropes because she's a great big boat. And you can see down towards the stern we've got a nice uh, swim platform there with a swim ladder and a ladder up to the stern to give you access to the back of the boat. So this has been Tim from Boatshed Drop Workers just taking you for a quick look at the hull in close up of this uh, this lovely looking boat. If you'd like any more information just go to boatshedbrighton.com for lots more pictures, videos and virtual reality. Thanks for watching.